We are one day away from what will be a solemn Sunday for the Tell City community. Visitation for Sergeant Heather Glenn is tomorrow at Tell City Junior Senior High School. She was killed when trying to apprehend a domestic violence suspect. Officials say there is a certain protocol to follow when an officer dies in the line of duty to make sure they get the recognition and honor they deserve. Eyewitness News Ann Powell has more. Every agency was be able to be afforded the same honors. A smaller agency like Tell City would be get to get the same honors that someone in Indianapolis would get because the resources aren't necessarily there. When an officer dies in the line of duty, the Indiana State Fraternal Order of Police Critical Incident and Memorial Committee steps in to support the family. They organize the visitation, funeral, and procession to the gravesite. For law enforcement funerals, it's a little bit different. We put all the officers in front of the funeral coach so that our officers, all the officers in attendance, are escorting our sister to her final resting place. Joe Hamer works with the Indiana FOP and is organizing Glenn services. He says a lot of tradition went into the planning. Anytime that Heather is transported, she is transported by police escort and she is also draped with an American flag. Before Glenn's visitation starts on Sunday, Hamer says the Tell City Police Department chief will conduct a flag presentation. Why the flag is being presented to Heather and how she has earned that American flag. The funeral begins at 10 Monday morning. When the officers and attendants are seated, they will be handed a white carnation to place upside down behind their badges. The white carnation symbolizes a good life and a good career, and the red dot symbolizes the blood that Heather has shed for her community. After the funeral, police will escort Glenn to the Greenwood Cemetery. On the way, they will stop at her cruiser for dispatch to read her final call. The procession will drive under a garrison flag, which is an American flag suspended with two ladder trucks. There is no traffic that is to go underneath that garrison flag except for Heather's funeral procession. Once at the gravesite, Hamer says there will be a riderless horse next to the funeral coach. A riderless horse is a horse that is being led by its handler or rider, and there are boots in the stirrups backwards. This is to represent a fallen comrade. Glenn will also receive military honors during the graveside service. And that we honor Heather the proper way. Hamer says the officers will place the white carnations on Heather's casket.